Hey guys, Luke here again with my mainland Lester. Say hi, Lester. There he is, this guy. Um, we have just a ton of stuff. We, we got to get through a lot today, you guys. It's, if you've been looking at the website, you've been checking out the Facebook, you've been reading the emails, we're, we're bloody well packed. Again, it seems to be coming, uh, it's, it's becoming a theme. But, uh, Lester, since we're doing antiques, do you want to start with my favorite piece? Yes, not the guy. Definitely. <laughs> Definitely the vintage arcade gaming cabinet. This thing is banana sandwich. We've had literally a lineup of staff just playing this thing all, all bloody day, which is like, it's got 60 preloaded games on this thing already. Uh, there's Pac-Man, there's Dig Dug, there's Galaga, there's Donkey Kong, there's Donkey Kong Jr., Ms. Pac-Man, bloody Frogger, Burger Time. Like, this thing is too cool. And I. There's part of me that kind of wants to put it in my apartment, but it's also one of those things of like, like, are you willing to get rid of the space the fridge currently occupies to have that and just like have, just have like a cooler? Like, anyway, that's not the only incredible thing we've got going on this week, guys. Of course, Lester, if you want to head towards the jewelry, my good man. We've got uh, all kinds of stuff. We've got, oh God, the amount of like, well, before I even start on the jewelry, the vehicles we have in this week, you guys. We've got four of them currently parked out back. They're all ready to go. All of them got the car faxes ready for your clean inspection. But the other big factor of this uh, of this uh, sale is the jewelry. <laughs> I've been shooting this. Like, look at the, if, if you're looking at this, click the link. Click whatever link I posted for you down here. And just see how many jewelry pictures I've had to take within the last week. Like, it's... It's silly, and I gotta use my big lens, and it's the fancy one, and it just, but like, like look at this. It, it's like we killed a pirate and just like, just emptied him out into the showcase. An absolutely insane amount of stuff, but of course, Valentine's Day is a week away. So if you guys are searching for that last minute gift, if me saying Valentine's Day is a week away is what reminded you that Valentine's Day is a week away, well, this Sunday's your opportunity to rectify that situation. Come to think of it, I still have not personally rectified that situation. But maybe I can get her something else. Uh, Lester, you want to head on down to the antiques, my good boy? Intrepid cameraman. Steps like a fine gazelle. Actually, if you wouldn't mind just showing him that slot machine we got up there, that's pretty cool. I'm really super into that. See, if I don't, like, because there's no way I'm going to be able to get that gaming cabinet in my house. But this could be a pretty cool, like, like, I have places I could put that. God, that's too... Anyway, that's not the only thing we have, of course. We're just up to our butts in antiques this week, you guys. We've got all kinds of stuff. We've got vintage collectibles. We've got vintage coins and currency. We've got vintage knives. We've got vintage apparel. We've got... The vintage furniture is actually really cool. Uh... Yeah, it's uh, just on your right. But well, the sewing machines, we have vintage sewing machines, of course. But that vintage bar, that red sucker, do you see that? Just on your left, Lester? That thing is too cool. That just makes me think of, if you've ever watched any of those like 1970s or 60s movies where there's like the open pit concept and there's always like the cool suave and like... That's, that's the kind of bar that makes me think of. It just makes me feel like I should be hosting parties that are way beyond, you know, uh, both my friend group and me personally. But that's not all we've got. We've also got some more modern stuff. If uh, the antiques ain't tickling you, I can't imagine why they wouldn't be, though. There's some really, really bloody cool stuff in there. Um, we've also got tons of modern appliances, tons of leather furnishings. As always, if you guys are looking to furnish a new place, you're looking to revamp the old one, now's the weekend to do it. And, like, the selection with all this vintage stuff is, like, just, like, now's the time. Um, that being said, that's not the only thing we have. Lester, if you want to start heading towards uh, some of the other auctions we got wrapping up this weekend. Um, you got enough? Have I given you enough rope? Yeah. But uh, those aren't the only antiques we got going on. I mean, this this was something I thought was really cool. These these like I put these in my Facebook friend groups and like just like the respect. Like, check this out. Friday the Thirteenth. These are the old like uh, oh god, what are the uh, the Selectivision video discs? Like stuff that like is niche enough that like me and only a handful of other people are gonna get but if you get this please like leave a like or something so I know that I'm not the only bloody one but like check it out they got crawl dude the, the glaive oh man okay and 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 of course who could forget death stalker composed 
by the legendary composer Rich Evans. That's right. Um, Lester, if you'd be so kind, we got, oh God, we got the other thing we got going on is we got the tool sale wrapping up this weekend. Um, it's this Saturday, so if you guys are looking to uh, get your construction business a little more, a uh, little more fanciful, get a little more projects under your belt, or if you're just, you know, want to start getting into a little, uh, little heavier work yourself, well, that's now's the opportunity to do it. You got automotive needs you want to take care of. Now's the weekend. You got construction needs, you can do woodworking, bloody plumbing for God's sake. It's all up, but only until this Saturday. So make sure you're getting your bids in. Make sure you're checking that bidders list and make sure you're uh, you're getting what you want out of it but that oh, and this is the part where I start running out of breath again because the amount like there's so many to, restaurant auction also ends this Sunday so if you guys are in the market for some high-grade restaurant gear you're trying to build now that the restaurants are opening up back again I can finally get Korean food that isn't you know gluten-free and cooked by my loving girl time to jump on that is now if you're trying to revamp your own kitchen you want to bulk up your own culinary cuisine, now's the opportunity, but that is not the only bloody auction. Our final curiosity sale of the month is just around the corner, that's next weekend. The gals are just setting up all the stuff for it, Alex's stuff is just, oh, he's just, he's just got so much stuff, you guys, it's just it. But that sale is gonna be next weekend, so make sure you're keeping an eye open, make sure you're checking your email, you're hitting refresh, because eventually when that sucker goes live, it's gonna be, it's gonna be a fast one. <sighs> That's about it. <laughs> Lester, you want to say bye? Peace. <laughs> Take her easy, guys. <laughs>